All right, Sir Scoots here, and this time I'm with the man who's got tons of fans in the building, Virtus Pro's Taz. How are you, Taz? Nice to see you again. I'm good. Happy to see all the fans. Let's get right into it. You are the oldest guy in the building right now. Well, oldest player in the building. I'm a few years older than you. You're, right th you're 31, and you've been playing this game for a very, very long time. What keeps, you know, before we get to the Counter-Strike stuff, what's kept you motivated for so many years? You know, from a young guy playing the game in his early partied years, whatever, to husband now, father now, and you're still grinding just as intense as you always did. I think it's a competition. I think it's a, a bit of arrogance inside of me uh, and uh, something which I want to achieve, you know. It's like, I don't feel like I achieve, we achieved everything. I don't feel I achieved everything. Uh, there's constantly something I want to improve on. I work harder and harder and this drives me, you know. I get just drive from the competition and I want to achieve more and more and uh, nothing changes, you know. 17 years going and I had the same attitude. Uh, and the only thing I get tired sometimes is my teammates. <laughs> but it's, the, it, it's something which you have probably when you are in a marriage which you, mm. or when maybe you have uh, friends which you are you know, knowing for like 10 years and stuff like that. You just know the habits which are very like not cool yeah. and sometimes it's like a bit one word but it's like over the edge and stuff like that so that's the only thing but the other things are like you know I'm just a competition beast and I just love competition. And, and, and to that point you, you've you've been to every single major you've won one the last one in Poland you guys won beat Nip and a heartbreaker for them that was when they were on their like second place only little fest yeah. and destroyed them you know it, it pulled, that was amazing to see in front of the home crowd I want well, I want to point out something to you last major you won I was also at and working just so you know I went to the e-league one I wasn't working it you didn't win so here I am maybe maybe something's gonna happen here you know I'm here I, you're I, here I, I like the way you're going yeah, so yeah. hopefully hopefully yeah. this is a good, good luck charm sign the yeah. old guy is here yeah. for the other old guy so to your point about like uh, your teammates you've also always been a captain that doesn't instantly go, okay, you're the problem, replace the fifth guy, bring a new guy in. You work through the in-game stuff, you deal with the out-of-game stuff, and at the end of the day, you end up with a stronger, bonded team that can go through the, the fires, if you will, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think that this is the way we are working, but the th main reasoning behind it is that I always uh, cherish the people around myself, you know? I try to have people which I trust, I try to have people which I have fun to play with, or being around with, you know, and uh, I want to have good people around my, uh, around me. And uh, when I feel that I have good people who are not only thinking about themselves, uh, but they are also, you know, ready to help others, then I feel like I don't want to do changes, you know. Every change uh, we made, uh, we made with a hard uh, heart, you know. Only one change I didn't do with hard heart, it was kicking look. Uh, but uh, other changes uh, was always like really heartbreaking. And finally, after all these years, you know, you've found a great ownership group. You know, you, you definitely had your series of owners and bad contracts not being paid and all this stuff. And you finally seem to have found an ownership home, which probably, again, a guy your age with real responsibilities, obviously you have to, you have to pay the bills. That pressure goes away. You're very well taken care of, as long as you keep doing well and you do all you're supposed to do. So that allows you to just worry about kicking everyone's butt, I guess, right? Uh, I mean, this is even hard to say in words, you know. Uh, the support we have from Anton, the support we have from Virtus Pro from the beginning, this is like one word, trust, you know. You just feel a relief after like 14 years of, uh, like we know everything. We know how it was to earn like uh, 500 uh, euro per month. We know how was it for like over half a year without earning any money, yeah. going to compete for tournaments, knowing that win or lose will decide your fate in life. Not not in game, in life. Okay, if we lose two events in a row, I need to pack up and go and to work. I need to go do the different stuff because I don't have money to keep uh, myself and keep my family alive. There, there were moments yeah. where we needed to keep our families. You know, not only. Uh, people we you know close to like uh, wife and uh, daughters and stuff like that but also you know uh, in a higher degree so this was very stressful times you know we knew how it is to be in a good side bad side and when VP came uh, after some time the trust was just incredible you know and it keeps on going till, till now it just feels like it's family you know we'll assume that in your mind you're going all the way to the finals who are you playing in the finals? I would love to play against SK in the final 
just because they are so sure of themselves, just because Farah is so sure of himself when I talk with him, I would just want, I just dream of beating him in the final, you know, here on stage in major. All right, that's going to be it for the interview. Anything you want to say to your fans, to everyone in the arena? Uh, actually, uh, what I want to say first, I want to thank VP, Virtus Pro Organization. I want to uh, thank Roman, our CEO, for doing everything what he can for us to feel comfortable. And obviously, I want to thank our fans. Uh, can I say it in Polish? Yeah, we can look right at him. Chciałem wam podziękować za to, że jesteście. Mam nadzieję, że będziecie z nami. Mam nadzieję, że damy czadu, a wy nam w tym pomożecie. Trzymajcie kciuki i dopingujcie.